internet auntie auntie ren here again with another video if you are gracing us with your presence for the first time hello darlings how are you welcome my name is auntie ren and we do all things luxe here on this channel we talk about handbags accessories shoes clothing <laughs> labels we love labels we love monogram if that's your jam you're in the right place to so settle in thank you so much for visiting if you are returning hello darling how are you welcome back don't forget to sound off in the comments leave your channel if you're a fellow youtuber say hey or if you don't know, just want to say hello to that's fine and I'll say hello back or come visit your channel okay so still on holiday <laughs> and um, wanted to do a quick what's in my bag so um, whilst traveling to our destination we're on a winter um, getaway winter holiday um, doing some you know skiing and snowboarding and tubing and things of that nature whilst he, uh, on the way here i decided to travel with ding so this is my uh fendi sunshine tote in the medium size i took this one out um for the first time and this was my carry on my travel bag if you will um and where i had like you know all of my personal items with me so i wanted to kind of unload it and show you what fit inside i am obsessed with this bag i've gotten so many compliments even my husband is uh <laughs> has stopped and told me that's a really beautiful bag and he is not kidding it is so it is just so stunning in person i don't even know if i don't think i've done a what's in my bag this quickly after getting an item but you literally have been using this since i unboxed it and i'm obsessed so i did leave the um the long strap that comes inside i did leave that home it just wasn't <laughs> i i think I, I explained it when i unboxed it and if you didn't see that unboxing i will put that up in the i card so you can take a look at it but it's just not uh, it wasn't user friendly for me not right now not with coats and so on it just wasn't my jam i do prefer a top handle especially in the winter when i'm wearing like you know lots of layers and coats and so on i prefer a top handle and this just hits the the mark for me so i did not even bother bringing that so this is just one big open tote it's structured which i do like so you have a very structured silhouette spin it around it's all leather um no feet on bottom and no closure at the top so it has nothing it's just literally like a box <laughs> like you're carrying a leather box um it does have two little d-rings on either side here which are for the strap but instead of um instead of using it for the strap i attached my handy dandy um airpods so, and I've shown this before on my channel. I got this from Gucci. It's just my Gucci holder. I love mixing Gucci with all of these different other designers and, you know, mixing up the uh, monogram into it, obsessed. So of course my pods, and it's just easy access, right? To get to my ear pods. So I'm just gonna unload the bag really quick so you can just see what I'm, it's not too many pieces, not too many things, but like what some of the travel like must have, gotta have like easy access to, you know, when I'm out and about. Well, not out and about, just when I was traveling. Once I got here, I emptied out all of this stuff. So, but first things first would be my laptop. And in here is, this is my laptop sleeve. This is my uh, Louis Vuitton. I believe it's called like a document holder, if I'm not mistaken. And inside is my laptop so that I can do work or what have you on the go. This is a Mac, 16 inch MacBook Air. Um, and that's in here along with the charger, you know and all like the cables and so on are in here as well so that's what i'm carrying in there and then that was just the biggest oh this is getting i don't want to get makeup on my top <laughs> and then this is my cosmetic pouch small cosmetic pouch 
pretty simple, self-explanatory, just um, some like daytime toiletries. So you have like my Chanel egg, I have a lip gloss because I've always, I've always got a lip product. I've got a eyeglass cloth in here, a hand sanitizer, you know, things of that nature. Nothing super exciting. There's a hand lotion, another hand lotion inside there. And that's just, you know, easy to get to kind of toiletries. Of course, another lip product because <laughs> it just wouldn't be, <laughs> it wouldn't be me. Can you guess? Another lip product, yep. <laughs> uh, another Chanel egg. Now I have two, my two of them here. So that's another Chanel egg. I have my sunglass case, my Etui Lunette, which has my prescription sunnies in them. This is another must have item. I have my work phone. This is my card holder. So this is the Louis Vuitton business card card holder. I have <laughs> my key pouch, which has my car keys and my six ring key holder, which has my like home keys. And this is the Louis Vuitton six ring key holder in Damier Graphite. And this is in Damier Ebene. In case that's the first time you've ever seen that. And I have two masks since I'm doing Fendi today. I actually have Fendi on and I'll do some cutaways wearing, trying on this bag and like, like so you can see what it looks like next to my shape and next to my size. I'm five, seven and a half. We're about a size 18, 20 um, in ladies clothing, in US sizing. And uh, oh, that's about like an XXL. Um, so I have two masks in here. So I have my Fendi on today. So obviously rocking the Fendi one. And then that's pretty much it. So you can see what I meant by it's just one big empty hole. It's just one big empty piece, but I love that it, you can pack it up, stack it up. And it was not like, it holds quite a bit. Like I could still fit in there. I had a water bottle in there earlier. You could put, but I had it like, um, it's like a flask, like a, one of the refillable ones. So I had that in there, but be careful with like putting water and stuff because the lining is suede or it seems it appears to be suede. So you have to be careful because that is delicate and could stain. I would recommend, and I don't ever <laughs> recommend this, but I would actually recommend putting a liner in here or a, um, a, a bag a bag shaper in here. Um, not for the shape, but more so just to protect the inside, just so it doesn't get like funky. But I normally have all of my pieces in some type of pouch or something like that. So it's not that big of a deal for me. But if you're not big on pouches and you wanna just like throw your things in there, I would suggest you get um, a bag organizer or bag shaper in there so that it's lined and just protect the inside because the inside is so beautiful. It's this beautiful brown color um, and it's like this really beautiful soft suede or suede feel, but I feel like, I feel like it really is suede. Um, at least the way it smells and so on, it smells like suede. So yeah, so that's, you know, that's it for this. I'm obsessed with this bag. Love that it keeps its shape. Love how good it looks. Is it heavy with just the bit that I showed you? Yes, it is heavy, but I wasn't carrying anything else. Like this was it for me. Um, and then like my personal phone in my hand and that was pretty much it. So for me, it was fine. But if I was like, if I had my, my, my carry on my luggage, um, that I was pulling as well, if I was doing that and doing luggage as well, then I would put, be able to roll this on the luggage, but like this and like another bag, if I had like a duffel or something and the rolly and stuff like that, it's too much. It's, this is literally like this bag and maybe one other piece and that's it. Maybe like a rolly luggage and that's it. And then you drop off your rolly luggage or you check, check the rolly luggage in and then you're just walking around with this, that's comfortable. But if you have another bag or you're trying to hold another bag with this, then it can become a bit heavy and a bit cumbersome because this the strap for me was not comfortable. So I didn't bring the strap. So I've only got top handle. So then I lose a hand and I didn't want to be like, 
you know, I don't like to move around and travel with too much going on. I like it to be simple and carefree. I don't want to have to look for too many things. So I like it. Yeah, I like it for travel so far, but like not if I had like too much luggage. If I was traveling with a lot of luggage, then no, I would have went for like a backpack or something instead. But it's a beautiful flex. This color is amazing. I'm obsessed with the color. As you know, it's, it suits me. It fits so many pieces in my wardrobe and recent buys that I have. And yeah, I love it. So going to be rocking this for my trip as my purse, as my day bag, um, all the things, unless like we're going out to like dinner or something like that then i would do a smaller um some smaller bags that i brought with me but i'm obsessed so that's that what fits inside of the fendi sunshine tote in the medium size if you want to see the unboxing of this i've recently unboxed it i want to say like two or three videos ago by now um so I'll, I'll link it in the icard so you can get to that so you can see when i unboxed it how much it cost me you know all the things all the details but that's it nieces nephews fellow aunties don't forget to like comment subscribe hit that bell notification so you know when auntie ren is here dropping these gems these travel tips these lovely lovely travel bags that we're obsessed with these hitters <laughs> all of the things thank you so much for tuning in for another one hope to see you in the next video hopefully i'll be back home by the time this goes up or by the time yeah, all right after this, I'll be back to, we'll be back to our regularly scheduled program and regularly scheduled location, but can't lie, definitely digging the lighting and the view um, here at our holiday home. But anyway, hope everyone is doing well, stay safe, and I'll see you in the next video. Talk to you soon. Bye.